down in Bondi Beach. Get surfs up. We're in Hall Street in Bondi. So people in Australia, banana bread is a thing. On uh, TikTok and Instagram. Yeah. Yeah. So how do you spell that? L U K E A L B U R Y. That's the nine. That's the nine. She's been here too long, giving no, away no. points for free. <laughs> giving points so we've just arrived here in Bondi Junction Station. And we're gonna go catch a bus down to the beach. And the bus we I usually catch to the beach is the, the half devil. I call it the half devil. The bus is number is 333. Oh Man, this used to be my spot back in the day to get our banana bread back in the day. Banana bread is the thing here. But uh, we'll have it down at the beach, I think. But this, this, this little spot here, because I used to live here in Bondi um, when I first moved here to Sydney. Stayed here around five years. And I used to, <laughs> I used to um, come here and pick up my coffee and banana bread before I... I went to work. So it's good to be back in the, in the area. And this is Bondi Station, guys. Long escalators up to the top. This place is usually full of foreigners. A lot of travelers. A lot of travelers from uh, around the world usually park up here in Bondi, maybe because, uh, because of the beach. But a lot of, you see a lot of Irish, a lot of um, South Americans, Brazilians, Colombians, a lot of uh, people from Europe, from all over, you know, from the UK. The place used to be full of Kiwis back in the 70s and 80s and 90s. There's still some around, but um, it's mainly a lot of foreigners. But also this big Jewish community is right here in uh, Bondi. Ooh, but when they... Windy guys, sorry. Yeah. A lot of memories in this area. So we're going to catch the half devil to the beach. That's why I call this bus the half devil because it's the number is three three three. As you can see. guys before every time I hop on this bus it's all is about 15 different languages spoken Okay, we're 
out of here. So, across the road is the beach, but we're not going there yet. Ooh, nice day. It's a beautiful day today. Beautiful day to come out here and show you people what's happening. So, I just love being in Bondi. I used to live here for around five years. And um, always used to like coming down here. Still looks the same. Usually this place here has usually got a market. But I don't know where it's gone. So I'm here in Bondi. Day in the life, of course I can. As we do. So say hello to my friend. You might remember from my other video, <laughs> King's Cross video. How's things? Pretty good. Yeah. Always good when the 163 is in town. That's it. <laughs> This, this spot here. The acai bowls. Oh, acai bowls. Oh, uh, Brazil. The Brazilian oh acai. So acai. Mm -hmm. Oh, do the bang. Might have to come down here for the acai. Yeah? yeah. It is? Yeah. Okay. Might have to get a smoothie later from acai. So, how's things been um, with you nice. since I last seen you? I'm pretty good. Yeah. yeah. I'm holding a pop-up op shop, a pop yep. shop over there. Yes. Um, brought it down from Warner's Ave. And so yep. that's had a really good response because we're just letting people know about the organization and what we work with and um, make some money. That's it. It's well, always good in the eastern suburbs. Cause. Always good in the eastern <laughs> suburbs. So I'm going to take you to one of these streets here. Hall Street is one of the streets I used to frequent quite a bit when I was a bit of a... Uh, uh, a latte cappuccino kind of guy <laughs> so here this street here in Hall Street it used to be one of my favorite spots uh, up here I don't know if the cafes are still running but there's a lot of cafes up here Custo's been here for years yeah yeah Custo's been here for a long time mm. that's right Over. so we're in Hall Street in Bondi it's a nice um, Thursday morning before lunchtime going out for, to get a coffee. We're going to taste the coffee uh, compared to our Wellington coffee because, you know, we do. Uh, we're going to go to this cafe over here. Uh, so, people in Australia, banana bread is a thing. In New Zealand, we have it as cake, but this guy's uh, banana bread is actually a thing. This is brownie. No, not the brownies that you guys are thinking about. Do you want to sit outside? <laughs> yeah, we'll sit outside. Oh man, yeah. What's this cafe like, brother? Is this the business? Is this the place? Yeah. Yeah, one of the best. Anyone best, want to find out? Best coffee? I hope so. Okay, well, we'll, we'll soon see. Hey. Got a cuz? Oh, look at this. Got me and all cousins working here. <laughs> Bro, what's in here in the world, my G? I know. Get to bed, how you say, doing? Kia ora to the, to the whanau. Oh, kia ora whanau, how are you yeah. today? Yeah, I've got my yeah. little brother here. My man, George. Oh, we're going to sit down and have a car, cuz? Yeah, we'll, we'll be outside, cuz. Come okay. on, we? Come out. I'll go for it. Okay. You're hey. doing your vlog. Ha, oh, wait. Well, are you in it now? <laughs> Thank my you. Man, my man's in it now. Got him uh, into the vlog. Oh, see, <laughs> come back to, to Bondi and... Yes. So, <laughs> hey, Hori's in there working. I don't know he's a chef in there. Who? My, my bro, really? uh, George. Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay, so here. Thank you. What do you have an oat latte? Yeah. An oat flat white. Well, we're getting an oat flat white because it's what I usually have back home. Yes. You're and uh, don't judge, one. guys. Um, I used to be a long black guy. <laughs> then, um, then you know, uh, th those ones I only pulled out when, uh, you know, when you need a bit of energy, a bit of uh, boost in your day. But 
Guys, we're trying to film a video, man. Cut, cut the noise out. <laughs> so there's my friend Mina, a very good dear friend of mine. Aww. So, how's things in Sydney lately? Well, what's the mood? What's the, what's the vibe? Oh, it's been like super hot already. It's been, should we place yeah. the order? Yeah. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Sorry. I'm a star. <laughs> uh, yeah, can we please have a toasted banana bread with butter and an oat flat white? And um, I'll have a green juice, please. Yeah. What is small or a large? Um, a large, please. Thank you. Do you mind being a town low? Yeah. Is this YouTube? Yeah. yeah so you're going to be famous. <laughs> okay, I'm going to be the star. Yeah. going to be the star. Thank you. Yes, she's going to be the lovely star of our show. Okay, she's going to be a monster. <laughs> Don't tell her that. Okay. <laughs> but um, yeah. So, yeah, it's been good. It's been really, really, yeah. really hot. So like... I know, it's been hot lately. Yeah, like 37 degrees and stuff. I know. Um, so you've got the good weather this week. Exactly. I mean, it was, insane. I was out west and it was like I jumped into the oven. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it was so, so hot the other day. <laughs> yeah. Man, it was so hot. That's why I only bought like jandals and a few teas. But yeah, we've got the cowboy. So he's here, Rippy the Cutter Boys from the Boss Lane. Rippy, Rippy the Cutter Boy shirt from the Boss Lane clothing. And we'll be talking about that on, on the vlog coming up about, uh, about the merch. And thank you people for getting me to uh, 5,000 subscribers. I remember when I still had one. I was, bro, I was tripping out when I had 10. I was like, oh my God, I got 10. That, that's it. Oh, the man, fly, flies. Mate. The flies is attacking you. The flies, yeah. The flies here are terrible. The flies are so gangster; they just attack you. Yeah. They do drive-bys on your ears, you know, your like, face. You know, in the outback, yeah, with the flies, and they're so yeah. like full on, and it's so dry. So they are always trying to get into your eyes and stuff because they can sense the moisture's in there. Oh yeah. That's why you need you need corks on your cap, cause. Yeah. So guys, I just got my coffee here, and we'll. We will see. We will see. Can you hold that there? Yeah. Just there, just there. We just got our coffee here. And we're going to taste it out. You know, we're going to test it out, see if, uh, how good it is compared to the Welly coffee. Pretty good brew. Pretty smooth. So I will give this probably a 7 out of 10 not quite a, a 9 or a 10 like we find at home but hey <laughs> it is what it is so not a bad coffee guys pretty good i said 7.5 out of 10 there you go still good you gotta say something for your banana bread okay but you know banana bread is a thing here banana bread is actually a thing here i didn't know that until i moved here How back in the day banana bread in New Zealand, don't we? no we don't have banana we have banana cake we don't have banana bread like they got banana bread with everything like if you go cafe here they got banana bread you know like how back home will have muffins they have banana bread so my, a lot of people have banana bread and um, unfortunately i sort of bend the knee and kind of got into the banana bread thing <laughs> so when i was when i was back home i i kind of missed the banana bread so i'm gonna have a banana bread here so we'll see when when it comes out have it with our coffee maybe that'll help pick the coffee up to an eight yeah. What do you what do enhance you think? It. Yeah, exactly. Be offset it. I might enhance the beans. <laughs> yeah. So guys, this is what I was talking about the oh banana my God, bread. It good. They caramelize that Whoa, shit. the banana bread toasted. Let's go. Look here. I haven't had a banana bread since I've been here, so this will be my first banana bread. Like I said, it, it is a thing here in Australia. I didn't even know about it until I moved here. And then when I went home, I actually kind of missed having banana bread. Yes, I know, don't judge me. I did sort of, um, it wasn't my moment of weakness that I decided to side with the, with, with the Aussies and, and, and enjoy banana bread. Come on, mate. Mate, look at this. Banana bread, but Oh my God, very posh, eating it with a knife and fork. Yeah. That looks good. Mmm, that's good. Coffee. Should have. 
are nice and toasted. Beautiful. Oh. And what? What's up with the crumbling? <laughs> oh. Eating this food, you get into a happy moments, and this is one of the happy moments. I love banana bread. What would you give it out of 10? I give this an 8 out of 10. An there 8 out of 10. So, there's a video from Day in the Life and oh, of what I get up to here in Sydney. That is very good. Very good, eh? That's a 9. That's a 9. Mm. She's been here too long, giving no, away no. points for free. <laughs> giving points away for free. Well, obviously, she hasn't tasted the New Zealand bakery stuff, you know, for a long time. So, this excuse me. Excuse her, her You're taste right. buds, her taste buds have gone, uh, you know, corrupted, you know. Well, I went back home and rejuvenated my taste buds. Oh, <laughs> bro. And it's just like, everything that I thought was a 10, was well, actually a 7. Yeah, this is true. This is true. <laughs> oh my God, it's so true. It's so mm. true. They lied to me. That's why when you go, when I go to New Zealand and then I come back, I'm like 10 kgs heavier when I get off the plane because everything's so delicious. All the bakeries. Exactly. Are so good. You know, you put that weight. You put that weight. Yeah. What do you know about love handles? <laughs> love handles. <laughs> we go with. Yeah, it's my my brother here. Kata, 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 yeah, like making cost. magic, making magic in the kitchen. You know how we do. Uh, that's it. A little bit of salmon, a little bit of that. Yeah. Of and he goes. See, look, he got that from up, up the wires. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we were, we were close this year, man. Oh, man, we got rolled, brother. We Fucking were close. Now, best year, best year, ten yeah, years. We, we used to watch Warriors together. Thanks, <laughs> I'm in. Okay, who's? Okay. Yeah, <laughs> that's my man, George. We used to watch Warriors <laughs> together up at his place all the time. He had Bondi back in the day. Um, it's a small, it's a small world, it's a small world. But um, thank you, thank you, Lena. Pleasure, pleasure. pleasure. Hey, brother, how's it going? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah, thank you. No, always a pleasure. It's always a pleasure to see you. Yeah. See. Well, it's good to, to know you got you got some good people here on the ground in Sydney. You know, Sydney is the second home to me, and um, but I'm still welly, 04, black and yellow. You know we do. <laughs> That's it. So Bondi, you have to have your active wear and a yoga mat to be in with the in crowd here. <laughs> in with the thin crowd. Exactly. I'm like. Why you got active wear on when you're not very active? And a yoga mat. Why you got a yoga mat when you don't even do yoga? But that's, it's a thing here. A lot of ladies, I see them walking around with yoga mats and active wear. So, so I'm down here in Bondi Beach. Gonna quick look. Like I said, I've done two videos here in the past, so please go go down to my catalogue and uh, look at my Bondi videos, Bondi Beach videos. But um, I'm here on a Thursday, Thursday lunchtime. Not many people because people, a lot of people are working. Um, but it's still quite a bit of a crowd here today. And this Ferris wheel here, let me show you up there. That wasn't here when uh, I was last living here. That is new for me anyway. And we're back in Bondi Beach. All is good to come down here. It's a cool place. I mean, when people land in Sydney, this is usually the place they associate with Sydney as far as beaches are concerned. But Sydney's got a lot of beaches. This is just one of them, and probably the most famous of them all is the Bondi Beach. Yeah, it's pretty hot for some. Out here, 
That's what's up. It surfs up. There's a few surfers out there on the beach. Over the bridge. <coughs> right. That was a quick walk down the beach. Like I said, I've already done two videos at the beach already. Bondi Beach. Bondi Beach. Yes. My man here. Hey. You do socials? Yeah. Say hi to everyone. Hey, what's up, peoples? That's it. My name's Luke. Ah, uh, Cos. Cos? Yeah. I just got abused from someone. She told me to go fuck myself, pretty much. Yeah, that's no good. What's your name, brother? My name's Luke. Yeah, where are we from? Originally, yeah. from the Gold Coast. Yeah. But I just moved up here. How you like Bondi? Love it. I just don't like the roads. Okay, don't like the roads. I get lost confused and they're shit and old roads but and i see you on your socials there i am on socials i am oh, what's what? your name tell everyone cause yours. cause i can the youtube channel so yeah. make sure you tap into cause i can the youtube channel that's it and then okay. and then so we find all this on there yeah you'll find on you'll find me on youtube mods make so. sure you get that down I'll exactly later. my man yeah so uh, what, what's your what's your tags luke aubrey on uh tiktok and instagram yeah yeah so how do you spell that L-U-K-E-A-L-B-U-R-Y Okay There you go Check my man out on TikTok And on IG So this guy here is making. Are you making waves? How many subs uh, How many followers you got? I don't know Like all up Like 500, 700,000 Okay but 500, 700,000 Just so You know Give and take my man. You, my man <laughs> My man Good Yeah to too much you. brother Same yeah. here oh, The breeze is out Even though the sun is out But Gives a bit of a nice cooler temperature you know because it can get really hot here and we're back at the bus stop so for those people that don't know before the YouTube game I was running a clothing label porcelain clothing that's why all this tag in the end of the, every video of most videos I say all this stay in the porcelain so tap in pull up uh, if you want to to know more about Bosling clothing and our merch because I'm starting to push the merch out now but the merch the clothing label came before the channel before the YouTube channel I already had uh, man the flies just <laughs> attacking me so Bosling clothing I was doing way before I did I started the YouTube channel so you know most people start the YouTube channel and they put the merch out I think I did it the other way around I had the merch and then I decided to do a YouTube channel. So it goes hand in hand. So when you support um, Bosslane Clothing, you're really supporting the channel because we're just trying to get more, more videos out there to you guys. And I would love to travel and uh, do more videos. That's the plan.